Hey what's up guys my name is Azim and welcome back to another new video and in this video we will be talking about some in depth of Samsung Galaxy S10 specifications and some leaks and rumors so without wasting any more time let's get straight into the video so the leaks showed that the S10 plus will have the display very close to Oppo Find X which have 93.8% screen to body ratio and Mi Mix 3 and we know that S9 has a screen to body ratio of almost 90% that is also close to S10 and iPhone XS Max have 82.9% these phones have a display ratio closer to each other and Samsung is working on its three variants of S10 where two will be the premium phones with edge curved displays and the third model will be equipped by flat screen. One will be S10 and the second will be S10 Lite and the third will be the S10 Plus model and in S10 and S10 Lite we will have two cameras while S10 Plus will have a three camera setup at the back. The Samsung S10 is going to be have the screen to body ratio of 93.4% that is super close to 93.8% that the recent Oppo Find X had. Ice Universe later tweeted on 14 May that the S10 screen is rumored to exceed 600 pixels per inches and the recent leaks have claimed that both premium Samsung Galaxy S10 will have the ultrasonic in-display fingerprint reader and the Galaxy S10 is coming with the display size of 5.8 inches while the Galaxy S10 Plus will feature a 6.4 inches screen and we will have a larger screen on the both devices the S10 Plus will be the mega powerhouse because it is coming with a larger battery of 4000 milliampere Samsung S10 is going to be the first phone having a hole like camera at the front top and killing the notch and recently Samsung introduced two new 0.8 micrometer pixel image sensors the one GM1 that is of 48 megapixels and the second one is GD1 that is of 32 megapixels and both of these sensors are based on latest pixel isolation technology named as the ISOCELL plus and being ultra small in size both of these sensors can give super detailed and sharp images and the tetra cell technology has done something big here by merging the four pixels into one to increase the light sensitivity and to give us the balanced exposure these sensors also support the electronic image stabilization to capture the fast moving subjects GD1 high dynamic range feature is also added which is also known as HDR and it is added to give you the more balanced and rich colors and details when filming or capturing and this can even work in low light by increasing the light sensitivity and this is stated that the Samsung new flagship might have these two 0.8 micrometer GM1 and GD1 sensors and here are the amounts of RAMs the Samsung and Huawei will be having in their next smartphones and the Samsung S10 RAMs starts from the base Galaxy S10 with 4 gigabytes and S10 Plus with 6 gigabyte RAM while Galaxy S10X with 8 gigabytes and at the last the Galaxy S10X 5G variant smartphone with 12 gigabytes of RAM and absolutely these all RAMs are going to be of DDR5 interface. Now here is the most awaited thing according to Android Central S10 will let you to enjoy the most fastest internet speed with 5G network because this will be the first smartphone having 5G connectivity. According to Ice Universe who has a good track record when it comes to leaking sensitive Samsung tidbits. He has revealed that the Galaxy S10 will come with next generation 5G technology on board. As Qualcomm and Samsung have both agreed with the 5G connectivity in S10, then the Galaxy S10 users should be able to benefit from the 5G connectivity that is hundreds times faster than 4G network. And stay tuned with my channel because in future I will be uploading and making more videos on the 5G network on the new flagships 
and here is also a bad thing Samsung is gonna do that other smartphones had already did is to ditch the audio jack yes guys Samsung is gonna take audio jack out from their new S10 and that is really really disappointing news for every Samsung user so that's all for today I hope you enjoyed the video a lot and stay tuned with me because I'm going to keep you aware with the latest Samsung news Samsung S10 news and 5G technology and I will see you guys in the next one